Jeez, guys, it really is too late for me to record this video. It is nearly one o'clock in the morning. I've got to get up early with the kids, but I can't help it. I'm going in the Gutenberg Shrine, or whatever it was called. We're going to do the last shrine of this Sky Island. Well, maybe, maybe the last shrine. I'm assuming it is. Let's go inside and see what our friend Raoul has to say. It's not called Raoul. Yeah, it's called Raoul. That's his name. Is he there? What's he going to give us? Ah. So you've made it here. Now then, extend your right hand. No problem, Buzz. Give me special powers, please, Buzz. So the other two have been sticking things together. Is this going to be sticking enemies together? We stick our armor and our shields together. Oh, weapons and shield. What is it? Ascend. Move upward through solid material and emerge on top of it. What? The ascendability. It lets you travel through what's directly above you and ascend through it and emerge on top of it. You'll find it quite useful in all sorts of places and situations. Mm. Ascend. Use ascend and receive the blessing from this shrine. Okay, right. Do you remember in the other shrines? They had those weird things on the ceiling, the green circles. And I was like, oh, where's the other chests? I know where they are now. They'll be in the green circles in the ceiling. And that's how we'll do it. We shall ascend through the green circles in the ceiling. I bet that's highlighted now. Or not? No? Ascend. <laughs> what? <laughs> what? Okay, maybe not the green things in the ceiling. Doesn't seem like I'm going to send through those. <laughs> what? I bet I missed the chest. You do get stuck in the floor each time, though. Maybe we'll get better at that. Hang on, mate. I want to go to the chest. A stone axe. But you can't carry it. I need to drop something. Let's get rid of one of those. There we go. Thank you. Alright, let's go kill that bad guy. Ascend! Hey, mate. Nice to see you. I'm going to kill you with... This one, I think. Although I can't have a shield with that one. And a shield will be good because he's got a bow. So maybe this dragon flame thing. Burn! Thank you very much. Can't carry any more of those. Oh, it's an old wooden bow. Rubbish. Don't want an old wooden bow. What I do want to do is smash those. And then ascend. Look at that chest. Amazing. A construct bow that I can't carry any more of. Uh, I don't know. Get rid of the one we're using. This probably took a little bit of damage. Okay. So what are the green circles in the ceiling for? Because it looks like there's more stuff up there. It looks like there's... Maybe they're like the other shrines, but why are the green circles in such strange positions? I don't know. There must be a way to get up them. Okay, we've got some rope here. Can we cut the rope? It gave us an axe a minute ago. We can. Ascend! Amazing. But, can I pick that up? I can't. It's mine. Can't do anything with it, though. Okay. That looks 
Is that something we can't... No, we can't send through that. It's a bit sticky. Okay. There we go, then. We ascended. All the way to... That was a pretty easy shrine. I mean, to be fair, all these ones have been easy so far. But yeah, nice easy shrine. Let's go get another bit of light. Let's eject a little bit more of that horrible stuff from our arm. And then we're going to go and open the Temple of Time. You have done well to reach this place. Hado, I'm incredible. We offer this light that will cleanse you of evil. Go a little bit more evil left, but not enough. We've got three lights of blessing now. But what can we do with them? Can we spend them? Are we going to use them to purge the dark, well, whatever his name is, the evil goblin fella away? Instead of throwing yourself at enemies over and over, to no avail, try cooking. I know. And there we go. We have done it. Chat with the master. Oh. I see you've restored some power to that new arm of yours. Mm. The door to the Temple of Time should now open for you. Thanks, boss. Appreciate it. Now. Over there, there is another one of those machines that gives many, many things. I kind of want to get over there. So let's uh, let's go. What's that sparkly thing? What was that? Did you see that thing sparkling then? Was it just a graphic? I swear I just saw this tree sparkling. Okay. Let's um, grab our axe. Oh, hang on a minute. No, no, no. No, what am I doing? This is exactly why this existed. We just cheated in the first place. Ascend! And we could have ascended into the Korok Sea thing as well. Descend would be useful, I think. Although, I suppose you're never going to know when you're going to end up just in the void. Yeah, I want to get over to that, which I can now do, because I have ascend. And, oh, look, our flying things that we're finally going to get, the ability to fly. How did it know we were going to do it in this order? How did it know? There's, a, there's another one here. There's flying things everywhere. Do we get to pick our favourite? There's a box here. Oh, man. Ascend. It's so good. Okay, so we've got a bit of a mix and match here. We need to move that thing. With this, so we can get it underneath, just like that. There we go. And then we can hit ascend. Jump onto that. Ascend. It's a little bit annoying, you gotta click pop out every time you get up, but I'm sure I'll get used to that. But it just seems a little bit of an unnecessary thing to do. But, uh, yeah, Ascend, why not? It looked like there were some more slots for other powers as well. Wing, a Zonai device that harnessed to lift the ride in the wind, fly further, balance in the center of the wing. So, okay, we're not just going to have one hang glider then. We're going to have the ability to have some, but also run out. So I guess the game's going to have to always give us an opportunity to get us a new one in case we need to get somewhere that requires it. Okay, so where was that? Oh, it's over there, look. We just literally went past it. Let's go check out these wing things. Oh, hang on a minute. One of them. Thank you. I'm going to need these. I want to buy lots of wings. Although it's random, isn't it? So I don't know if I'll get wings. I've got that one. Got that one. Let's 
let's uh, speak to this before we do that, because he might tell us something useful. It's bedtime. My duty today are complete. Oh, this is a rarity. It's unusual for me to receive visitors here. I assume you were required zonal devices. I'm fine. Oh, it's interesting to have a visitor after so long of isolation. I'm happy to address whatever questions you have. Good for you. I need to throw all of these things in here and get more wings. I knew it would give us more things. <laughs> Lots of wings. Yes, throw more in. No. Oh. Not what I meant to do, but okay. So it is, it's very Breath of the Wild in the fact that we needed the wing, i.e. the hang glider, to get to the next area. Oh, man. I love it when things do that. Like, this worked, so let's do it again, but make it completely different and unique. And they have. It is, it's the same game, but it is so unique and different and enjoyable. Right, okay, how many wings have we got? We've got 15. I'm sure that will do us for now. Let's uh, let's use this one, I guess. Can we just use it? How do we do it? Uh, it's not the ascend button. Do we pick it up with this? Or do we, like, attach it to something? But it glided. Sort of. I'm sure uh, old El Chapo is going to tell us how to use it. Excuse me, El Chapo. Can you tell me how to use it? Mm. The Zona devices were a pinnacle of our technology. We built an advanced civilization with them and flourished for many, many years. If you can master the use of the Zonai devices, your quest will be much easier. Mm. The Zonai devices are the pieces of the technology that was the foundation of... No. Just... So i got to figure it out. I mean... I kind of want to just stand on it and push it off the edge. Oh, does it slide down here? Do I just get on it and it will slide? That seems too simple. No? Do I need to put these two on the runners? Attack. Now I'm just stuck them together. I can have multiple flying machines. What? Go. That's all I need to do. Just do that. Oh my goodness. And I can I can steer it by walking around on it. No way. Okay, this is gonna take a bit of yet getting used to. But how cool is that? I wanna go in that direction. I wanna get to the temple of time Oh actually, let's go over here. Well, we can do it. We can make it. No, I don't think I gave it enough beans. Oh, wait. Okay, let's go this way. Look out. Watch your head. Oh, dear. Fish! Fish! Give me the fish! Well, it almost worked out well for me. Not quite. I want to go back and... Oh, dear. Oh, that's going to land on someone's head. I'm sorry. I'm, so I'm sorry, guys. Oh, where'd he go? Um... Maybe what's that? that's what happened to that dragon. Maybe someone was riding it and fell off. Uh, oh, I can't swim all the way over there. No chance. No chance. Don't even think about it, Link. Get out. We will ascend, potentially. Can we ascend through that leg? We can. Of course we can. We'll just jump on here. Wrong button. Ascend. No, can't ascend through that. Oh, you suck. Why? Why not? What's the point? 
No, you've got to go the long way round. And I want to ascend. I mean, that wasn't bad for my first flight, I don't think, considering I had no idea how you were supposed to do it. It was pretty cool, though. Oh, dear. That could have been a big, big mistake. Come on, Link, you can make it. You can make it, Link. Good job, Link. You made it. To the Temple of Time. It's about time we made it to the Temple of Time. Here we go, guys. Put away this stupid rock thing. And have I got a better shield that doesn't have a light bulb stuck to the back of it? I've got this one, I suppose. Let me in. I've just had a thought. We can make wind by throwing chilies on fire. I wonder if you was to put one of them aeroplanes on top of it, it would just boost you up into the air. Or the wings, sorry. This is fancy. It's a tear of the kingdom. And there's more of these door things that we were trying to get on in the in the first episode. The rotating things. That's what Zelda got, wasn't it? From the uh, came out of the bad guy at the beginning. There we go. Some exposition, please. Recall. Reverse an object's movement until it goes back to where it was. You can stop the reverse movement at any time. Okay. Hmm. Ah, recall. The ability to reverse the movement of an object through time. And Zelda has vanished as well. Hmm. What you just saw, a mystery even to me. Perhaps it was a sort of an echo, one that reflects her sheer will. <laughs> that you've now been given this ability, no doubt it will prove important. I hope so. Find Princess Zelda updated. Open the log. In the Temple of Time, you approached an altar. In the flash of light, you found yourself with Princess Zelda. That is, with some phantasmal floating vision of her. She took your hand and gave you an ability to control time that's known as recall. Now the temple's deeper mysteries await you. Okay. Cooking pot? Is it a cooking pot? I mean, it's not on fire, so I'm assuming not. Right. 
Right, yeah, recall then. Uh, <laughs> amiibo. Why did they even bother? Does it? Who ever uses amiibos? So, oh, so the first place that we were at, potentially we could use... And then we can stop it with L. Huh. But it doesn't stop for long. Okay. So, okay, this is so we can get out because we're going to fall in a lot. Can we stop it while we're on there? So, for instance, if we... Rewind now. And then jump on it. We could potentially get it to carry us across. There we go. Too, too difficult. Not so bad. Oh dear. It's going a bit far then. Okay, nice. Easy. Was that, I feel like I missed something around here. Did I miss anything? There's a, a space where you would expect a chest to be. Can I ascend? What about on the other side. Is there a chest? Or am I just obsessed with chests? No. Good space for a chest, though. If we were going to put one in the game, game. Just saying. Nice place to put it. <gasps> These things! Pray! Get some more life! Finally! Goddess, statue smiles upon you. Pray again. What? I thought we were supposed to like get some more life from that. Do we not have any? Are we supposed to collect something to give her? Huh. I can't remember how it works. Push. Hold. Yeah, we're not going to make it. We're not strong enough to open the door. The door stands to test of your overall virility. Mm. You remain in a weakened state. You're not strong enough to open it. But there is no one more shrine on the island. There you can get another blessing. Okay. <gasps> you add that to the other blessings you received at the shrines and offer them to the goddess. You might just find your way forward after all. Mm. Let me see the pure path. Purepad lets you travel to certain places instantly. Fast travel. Okay. Now you see all of the blue marks on the map. Oh, so you can fast travel to shrines. You can travel instantly to any of them. I suggest the one at the bottom of your map. Okay. Isn't that where we started, maybe? Use the travel function to reach that area quickly. You'll find the last of the island shrines around there somewhere. Yeah, I'm pretty sure it is. Because there was that blue light on the ground in the same room with these stupid things. Oh, I'm so glad we get to go back there. I was wondering how we would end up back there because it was so far away. So if I go to the Sheikah Slate then, go to the map, zoom in, I can select that, but I can fast travel here. The Room of Awakening, there we go. Straight back to the beginning. No way! So we're finally going to get to do that room that I couldn't climb up. <laughs> Yay. I wonder how many people actually managed to somehow glitch it and do it on their, like, when they first started. Here we are, guys, right at the beginning. Right at the beginning. Okay. Right, we're going to need... Uh... No, I don't want it yet. <laughs> I need to I need to do it like now. I've actually got an opportunity to jump on it. Yep. 
No, 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 that's not what I wanted you to do, Link. Okay, let's try that again. Ready, go. Man, why did I get on it? Not this all over again. We've even got special powers this time. There we go. Was there a chest on either of those ledges? There wasn't. Okay, so I'm going this way. Oh, I nearly missed that. So all that effort that I went through in the first episode to try and get up there to get the chest, there wasn't even a chest. Jeez. There is another shrine. And there's a chap. Hey, chap, what are you going to tell me? Good morning. This is a crystal refinery. I can take your crystallized charges and use them to produce energy wells. Yes, do it. Production will require at least 100 crystallized charges. Return when you've collected a sufficient amount. One note regarding zone out required to protest the crystallized charges. The mines on the island have nearly run dry. I doubt there's even enough left to produce an energy well. But there's more to be had. Check the distant depths in the world below. That's the original source. Okay, so we can go to... Oh, jeez. So we can go to the mining cave, which is... Whoa, hang on a minute. Oh, it's actually got it on the map already for us. That's pretty good. Oh, it's showing us where lots of mining caves are. So it's showing us the caves. So we can go there. I think it was the mining cave. Have they got little ticks on? They have, haven't they? That hasn't got a tick on it, and neither's that one. Where the stewards would turn it into the other things for us, and then we can come... Oh, it's got the device dispensers on here as well. Oh, that's useful. And uh, and then come here and get it swapped into these other things, whatever they are, which sound useful. I'm sure we're going to get one when we go into this shrine. And don't worry, guys, I'm not going to say it. I'm not going to say it in the next episode, because we're doing it now, guys. We're doing the last shrine. We've got time. We've got time. How hard could it be? The ability to rewind. Nakayoa Shrine. Let me write that down. I can't spell it. It's too late. Gone off the screen now. Does it tell me in here? I've been trying to write down the names of things as I've been doing it so I can remember what's in the video so I can do nice like titles and descriptions. But, um... Ah, oh, there we go. Nak o o your Nakoya shrine. There you go. And then I can uh, I can actually make the videos useful. Lovely. Okay, we got a rewind time, Jobby. Let's rewind this rap, shall we? Let's go back the other way. Don't mind if I do. Thank you, Mr. Raft. Appreciate it. Oh, do we need to get it all the way over here? Will it even go all the way over here? And did it come down? Oh, I see. That's all right. Wow, it's going to bounce. It's going to reverse bounce. Boing, boing. Amazing. Whee! Oh, that's fancy. I like it. Okay, there's a chest up there. I spy. My little eye, something beginning with C. And it is, of course, chest. Oh, I like this reverse time thing. It's very handy. Can I have it? Arrows. 
really, of all the things you could have given me game, is there any ascend things around here? So many arrows. Great. Uh, right, what we got going on here? Nothing. Ooh. We've got arrows on. Oh, I can do one but not the other? Was it like a clock? Do I have to get them to point to a certain place? Ah, when they're together. There we go. I see. I nailed it. So good at Minecraft, guys. It's Zelda. That's what I said. Examine. That was a bit of an easy shrine. Jeez, that was a really easy shrine. I mean, to be fair, they all have been so far, but that was beyond easy. I think I might skip this one, because they, they they go on a bit, don't they? You get a special light bulb. There we go. Thanks for the light bulb, mate. I can take it to the lady now. Skip. I know. I know. So I should be able to... We're quite high up on here. We're really high up on here, actually. If I remember rightly, we flew down a long way. A really long way. So I should be able to fly all the way... Oh, look, they've already got wing things up here. I should be able to fly all the way back. But there's probably other things I can fly back to as well. Or fly to. There's all of these things we could go to. Now that we're up here, including... That's not what I wanted to do. That dragon. We could fly over to that dragon. Why? Why not, I guess? But we could. We could fly in that direction and go over to those sky islands. I don't know how far my little glider will take me. We could go and land on the top of the Temple of Time. Oh, man. Where are we going to go, guys? Where are we going to go? And if we make a mistake, I don't know why I'm going through this. If we make a mistake with our glider. Hang on a minute. What was. What? What ability was that? It was just map. Map ability. What? If we make, yeah, we, if we make a mistake with the glider, we can just rewind it while we're on it and go back. Speaking of going back, there is stuff on the hill behind us. I feel like I can get it. It's Link's original clothes and the master sword that's fixed. Oh, all the stuff's on here. That would be nice. Not going to happen. But it would be nice. There's some stuff up here. A chest. I knew there'd be a chest. And another Korok seed, of course. What'd I get? An opal. Oh, another way. Three wings. Okay. Now, there must be a way to launch the wings without one of the wing launchers. That must be a thing. I don't know how. Maybe that will happen later on. But I think it must be a thing. Huh. What do I do here, then? It's clearly... A Korok thing, but what do I do? Examine. That would help. You found me! Thank you, mate. I take it. Good nine. Thanks for your Korok seed. Appreciate it, bro. I smell some dinner. There was a pigeon on there. Where's it gone? Not a pigeon. What's that? Oh, there it is, look. Filthy pigeon. What I call dinner. And some apples as well. Good, because we're getting a bit short of apples. We 
does make some strange noises, Link, doesn't it? Well, I guess for this game, they wouldn't have had to record half the amount of audio that they did for the first one, because they'll be reusing most of it. They're reusing some of the music. They're reusing all the sound effects. So the whole development cycle has just been on just making this game incredible, which they've done a really good job with. Emu! I need your meat, mate. Thank you. Thank you for your dinner. So yeah, how do we take off with those wings without having to use the ramps? There must be a way. I'm sure we'll learn it later on. But then that might be a way of just stopping you flying absolutely everywhere, so who knows. Let's go for a fly. Let's see where we end up. And let's try what I said about the recall thing. Let's just switch to recall. And well, let's take off on here. Get in the middle. I wonder, can I check? I can't do it with the motion controls, no. But if I do this, yeah, I can rewind it. Amazing. So if you make a mistake, you just go back. Incredible. Where are we going to end up if I just go in a straight line? Oh, look. That doesn't look good. That's one of those, yeah, those crazy box like dungeon things. Like a planet or a moon or something over there. I feel like we're gonna uh, we're gonna miss the Temple of Time. I feel like we're gonna go substantially over it, and we are getting quite close to uh, Ye Olde Dragon. Hmm. What does that mean? Why is it going green? Is it running out? Has it got durability? If it's got durability, then we have a significant problem. Oh dear. Okay, so it's got durability. But that's okay, because I'm above water. Oh, I didn't want to do that. Dive. Let's see if we can actually land in a decent place. Miss the lily pads. There we go. Nice. Ooh, that worked out well. So we can't go wherever we went on those wings because they don't last very long time. Okay. I wonder if we can use a thing to recharge them because we've got those, like, battery things. Or I just, I guess that's to stop you going to areas of the world you're not supposed to go to yet. Okay. Fair enough, game. I understand. I get it. Right. Uh, I don't want that one. I want... Uh, oh, I was on the right one. Anyway. I don't want it now. We're going to need this to get back up there again. So we can go and open that door. And get through to the next section. Of this incredible game. Press the right button. Here we go, guys. She's lit up. It's time. Get ourselves another heart. You have conquered the shrines and claimed the light of blessing. In exchange for four lights of blessing, I'll grant you power. Yes, please. What a heart container. Y yes. Uh, I shall grant you the power you seek. Thanks, mate. And it cost me four light things. <sighs> A rare item that restores some of the life force you lost to the gloom, increasing your maximum number of hearts by one. Hurrah! Go and bring peace to the world. I'm doing it. 
going to go bring peace to the world, Mum. I'm not a mum. Okay, Mum. So, I mean, no, miss. Hold. Using all my power. But I, I can make it. Oh. Just. There we go. Oh, gone blue. Ah, oh, good. I see you have managed to open the door. You haven't fully recovered yet, but that is to be expected. You were almost beyond saving. By visiting the shrines and receiving their blessings, you have mitigated some of the corruption's effects. Our time together has been brief. I am so happy that we finally met. You are exactly as Zelda said. I've done everything I can for her. Now it is up to you. Okay, Dad. Wow. The end. Oh no, wait. The beginning. Jeez. We've got a journey ahead of us, peeps. But unfortunately, it's going to have to wait for the next one. And that's really annoying because I don't want to stop. <laughs> I don't want to stop. I want to keep going, but I got to go. It's bedtime. Thank you all very much for watching. I'll see you all in the next one. Goodbye.